We will now take a look at the import documentation. Import documentation, though a little complex and cumbersome, is an integral part of international logistics operations. It is important to have good knowledge and understanding of these documents and procedures so that there are no mistakes in its compliance. Errors can result in delays in clearance of the imported consignment and penalties such as detention and demerit charges may be applicable. Okay. Now let us study the standard documents required for importing goods. A set of various standard documents as per customs rules are required for clearance of import shipments. To ensure smooth and quick clearance of cargo, error-free documents are essential. These documents are required to be produced to customs at the time of clearance from customs. In case the customs officer has any doubts, he can ask for any other papers to support the claim and clearance. Here are the documents which are as notified at Customs Manual for Clearance of Imported Goods. 1. Invoice Copy Invoice is the seller's bill for the goods sold by him. It contains the name and address of the exporter and importer, purchase order number, reference numbers, description of goods, price per unit, total value, the terms of sale and payment, BL or WB details, etc. This must be signed by the exporter. In case of LC import goods, the invoice must be endorsed by the respective negotiating bank. Invoice format 2. Packing list This document is a consolidated statement of the total packages in the shipment containing details of packaging. Example, number of boxes, pallets, or units per box or pallet, the volume and weight of each package, and the total volume and weight of the shipment. Example 4. Corrugated boxes on one pallet or 10 parts per box. The consigner and consignee details, terms of delivery and payment, description of goods as per invoice. Precautions must be taken to ensure that the details in the packing list Adhere to that on the invoice and bill of lading. Format 3. Bill of lading in case of sea shipment and airway bill in case of air shipment. This is a document issued by the shipping company or his agent acknowledging the receipt of cargo on board. The bill of lading is a very important document in international trade as it is a document of title of goods. Format 4. Cargo Arrival Notice, CAN. It is the notice sent by a carrier or agent to the consignee to inform the consignee about the arrival of the shipment. It contains a number of packages, description of goods, their weight and collection charges if any. It also indicates shipping line charges which are required for DO, delivery order. 5. Letter of Authority in favor of Custom House Agent. This is an authority letter given by the consignee to customs indicating that they are authorizing a particular customs house agent, CHA, to clear their shipment from customs on their behalf.